and welcome back to another video. This time I'm cooking to death because of the bleeding heat. Alright, it is currently um, 23 degrees. Now, American, I always hear that, oh, Americans are like, oh, that doesn't sound like it. It's like, bear in mind, it, our houses are built to keep heat in. And they're really good at keeping the heat in. So, yeah. Um, they're not, gonna, not too good, especially when you don't have air con. Like I've, all I've got is this little fan that's keeping me cool. And my and like I'm not even like properly dressed. I'm just I'm literally just like in my pajama and dressing gown just because it's it's just too hot to wear anything. Um, but yeah, uh, let's get, let's get into, uh, elemental bending add-on. Now, when I saw this, uh, my first, um, first thing that popped into my head was Avatar the Last Airbender. Um, mainly because one is a bleeding great TV show, and two, um, yeah. They called it elemental bending, like, come on. I think they were purposely trying to, like, make you think of Avatar The Last Airbender. Well, there's nothing wrong with that. And it's night time. Do I not have my helmet on? Do I not? Um, yeah, I do have anyway. So what let's get this done before the heat melts my brain. Right, so uh oh this is a cool cool walking ball call on if we get into F5. Yeah. Not gonna mistake it for any of the other books. Let's just go down into the uh, storage area. Oh! What? What's the zombie doing? Baby zombie doing down here? Die, baby zombie, die. Yeah. Um. So, yeah, let's take a look. Cool book. Uh, well. Uh, welcome, fellow bender! Conquer six spending styles with uh, chaos infused tools. Element each element unlocks three u unique powers. I oh excuse me, oh, excuse me again. Are you ready to abandon nature? Outsmart to nature's guardians and an the inch closer to becoming the ultimate elemental master. Contents. Six elements, six unique weapons, uh, bend, twist, and conquer. Fire, electric, air, air, water, and spirit. Now, all of these, we're actually in Avatar. I obviously got to fire, water, air, and air, which is just, you know, air. Um, but then you also have electric, which was, uh, uh, you could do lightning bending, which was a subsection of fire bending, and spirit, uh, spirit bending is what Ang did, uh, spoiler alert here, it's what Ang did to beat the fire lord. So, I, I, I'm one of the really big fans of Avatar Last Year Bender. All this is a lot of coincidences. <laughs> Abilities, fire staff. Fire whirlpool, a blazing whirlpool, a shredding whirlpool, spiling. What? Oh, hold on. What is that word? Ah, let me take a closer look. Spiling to power. That doesn't. That that way. That last bit doesn't make much sense. Yeah, fire breath. Unleash a blazing fire breath. Fire stun. Fire uh, cracking out. To with uh, from the uh, air. Defeat the fire guardian, there's nasty fire essence to be able uh, to forge stuff, so... Oh, I think you've skipped, skipped, skip, skip, skip. God damn it, my brain's already melted. I think you've skipped a st step here, book. 
You should be telling us about the fa about the guardians first, so we know where to get the essences, and tell us about the uh, weapons, so, so then we have everything we need to craft them. So let's just skip over the. I'm just going to skip over the weapons for now until we get to to the uh, guardians. Here we go. Fire guardian spawns naturally in the Nether. Earth guardian spawns naturally in the uh, plains and jungle. Electric guardian spawns naturally in a deep dark biome. Air Guardian spawns naturally in mountains. Water Guardian spawns naturally in ocean biomes. Spirit Guardian spawns naturally in cherry blossom biomes. Okay, not too difficult, so let's go kill a Fire Guardian. Itching nose. Yeah. There's a 1DT here that we can just hit to drink this potion. I really wish they did implement that update where they made it so that you can't be attacked when you're loading into a world. Or uh, the never. Already, like this shouldn't have even been a thing in the first place, like, why? Like dying as I come into the never has been a pain in the ass multiple times, why can't I? Alright, go away. Look, I'm just looking for a fire guardian, and none of y'all are a fire guardian. So go, I do. I hate this biome. Worst biome ever. Uh, I don't have a morph gun on me, do I? My inventory is full of random stuff. Yeah. That P more. Morph gun on foot. Uh. I'm going to be in LA. Ow. So it says they just spawn naturally in the nether. Don't know whereabouts in the nether they spawn naturally. It just says in the nether. Oh, go out. Hold on, I have a, I have a crossbow. Why am I... There we go. Yeah, damn it. Damn it. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's two here. Okay. Oh, and there's the glint. And lag. And the ghast. Everything's come to kill me. Oh, there's another two. Wow, these guys actually spawn quite often here. Oh, the fire has got spirit in the fire. <laughs> Irony. Ah. Uh, Die already! Die, there we go. So I've got 57 essence from them. Probably more than you'll get because I've got a looting uh, and plundering sword. So I tend to get a lot of loot. Oh, go away. How do I get up here? Uh, go away. Yep. Oh. Right. Ooh, Give me a minute, I'm just gonna do this and that might help with the lag because it's lagging a bit. Doesn't usually like this bad. There we go, much better. Oh wait. Uh, ah. mm -hmm. A bit. Ah. There we go. I'm just gonna dump everything I don't need into here.
Okay, so let's go see how like how I craft this fire stuff. All the enchanted fire stuff, and then you have fire breath. Oh, so I need two sticks. So we have an unenchanted fire staff. Now, craft the abilities in the staff. Ah, for the staff to remove. So, then you have to craft the abilities themselves. It's just like, ah, oh, a bunch of fire essence. So, one of them, one of them, one of them. Do they get used up when you use... Grab the abilities into the staff to... Oh! So I put that there, so let's go... Now... Uh, what's that? Oh, your staff item. Ah. Yeah, that's... Uh, so this world is a bit buggy, so you might get the... Uh, the item in there, and it might not just be invisible, but this world is a bit buggy. Uh, as you'll see, if you've like seen the thickest construct add on, this world is just particularly buggy for some reason. So we've got fire breath. Oh, that's cool. Let's go test it on 1DT over here. Wait, does he have three llamas? I didn't know they could spawn with three llamas. Oh wait, no, it's, he doesn't have three llamas. He's got two llamas and the third one's just spawn. So then, I think I'm like, one was jump and right click, fire stun. I'm like, shit. I'm cool uh, Hold on, let's go back to the book and ask the, uh, check the book. Okay, pick the book up. Put the book down. There's right click, crouch and right click, jump and right click. Ah, so I just need to do regular right click. Uh, panda over here, let's kill the panda. And it's a fire whirlpool. Oh, that does look cool. So, what is the range for this? Ah. Oh. oh. There you go. So, could I just like right click over there and will it spawn one over there? No, it spawns it right in front of you. So, it does have a limited range. I can't just like spawn one all the way off in the distance over here. If I kill a cow with this, does it give me a oh. treat? Oh. Nope. Would have been cool if it did give you cup to meat though. Could I just like spawn one up there? Nah, it just spawns like right in front of you. Yeah, it would have been cool if it had if it, if like the stat the fire staff gave you more range with your attacks. Because then, you know, it'd be ineffective. Range of I mean, shift right clicks decent, with, has a decent range. A little bit of a slow charger, but it's like more mid range where the other one just like places it right in front of you. Yeah, that one has a bit, is, uh, has a bit of range as well. Alright, moving on to the next staff. Hold on. Well, we need to find the Earth Guardian now. It says it spawns naturally in plains and jungle. I don't know where a plains biome is, but I do know where a jungle biome is. It's over in this direction. Actually, 
Oh. Yeah, because I reviewed this before the armadillo came out. I've just unlocked the armadillo. Come on. Yeah, because they added the... Uh, the armadillo, and they also... Uh, No, I think it was just the armor there. I think we just done. Uh, yeah. Ignore him. This is a copy of my uh, survival world. And he was just a villager I was going to use to make a uh, raid farm. And you know, they're a little bit less effective, but I'm, I should. If I get back to doing some solo survival, uh, that wasn't entirely solo. This area that we're going to now, my friend was making a basin, but he just like, kind of, he's he's just like one of those kind of people that just like, will talk to you for a bit and then he'll stop talking to you for a bit and then, they just go hey, missing for a while and then he'll pop back up and as if nothing happened. It's very annoying. Alright, so this is a jungle biome. So let's go into an LA. Um, oh, it's night time. Uh, let me get this remote. Change back to human. God damn it. Bad Lily! This part is not jungle. Need to go over here. This part's jungle. There should be some spawning around here. Stop it, Lily! No woofy woos. Give you a little sort of snail shot, you up. I've not seen any earth elementals. When I was in the nether, there was a bunch of fire ones, so I don't know what's going on with the earth elementals. Hello, any earth elementals? Does it need to be night time for them to spawn? I didn't say it needed to be night time. It needs to be night time, it should have said that it needed to be night time. And that's okay. Big cave. Oh, there's a creeper there. There's an earth elemental. Hi, I'm a, I'm a stab you in your face. Oh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Sometimes the teleporting ability on my arm is a bit annoying. Now I can't find him. Where'd he go? Where'd he 
Ah, there he is. There we go. So yeah, they're not super common, so if you're basing in a jungle or a plains biome, you don't have to worry about them too much. Well, there's another one. How much HP do they have? Because I have the HP bar add-on. On. So if I stab him real quick. 50 HP. Okay, they might be a little bit of a problem at 50 HP here in the game. Yeah, uh, not super common spawn, so yeah. I, I want to be careful of them if if it's early game. Oh well, there's a massive crevice going all the way down there. That's where it is. Yeah, no. yeah. Neat. He's a big one. So let's head back to the base. Well, actually, I can just. Uh, teleporter. Boom. Right now. Oh, at some point I need to erase my uh, teleports because I definitely said. Ah, oh, that's annoying. When did that happen? How did that happen? Why did it happen? I do not know. Oh, I'm gonna say lay and. And this cat that gives you speed. I just remember they also added that so they can change how your cat looks at random. See in the top right there, you can see it's changing. Anyway. Human. Teleporter. Delete teleport. Um. Teleporter. Um. There we go. Alright, so now that we've got the earth elements, make the. Oh, I'm going to put the fire in there. Make the oh, and I need two sticks. Keep a stack of sticks on me. No, oh, and that's fire stuff. Oh, I got plant fire, but great. Alright, uh. Uh, oh, I need three bricks, not sticks. Uh, would be in here. Yep. Bricks. One of these. One of these. One of these. One of these. And then one champion. 
If Glove Enchanted, again, texture information, but that's probably just because of this well, because it's this well. Is a bit. Okay! So we have the right click ability, which just sends out a shockwave, which is pretty cool. We have shift right click, which just punches them and does two. Oh, that only does two damage, that's a bit. So, and then jump right click, which makes a rock wall. Oh, that, that is cool. And that actually goes quite far. Oh, and it pushes them as well. Doesn't do a ton of damage, but yeah, pretty cool. No wind jewels. What are you wind you ruin for? I'm more fan on you. Yeah? Actually, did stop her from winging. Huh. Maybe that was it. Maybe she's like the fan. Then we have the Electric Guardian spawns naturally in the deep dark biome. I do not believe I ha- oh wait, I think I actually do. Uh, all the way down here, if I remember correctly, or I could be misremembering. Uh, LA. LA, 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 LA. Uh, no, I'm misremembering, I must be another one of my worlds. Uh, oh shit, it's dark. I guess I could uh, locate deep. Uh, can I locate aim? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, biome deep dark. So, we can now locate that structure for me, game. Oh, biome, sorry. Why are you now locate deep dark? Ancient city? No. Why? Why are you now working? Okay, so I'm going to be back in a minute and I'll uh, use chunk base to do this. Alright, let's get... The, right, so it should just be straight down from here. Ah! Oh, great, now there's water. Lots of candles. Oh, I'm just gonna change back to human. I can see. See what I can see. Oh. Alright, so this is the ancient city, so it should spawn somewhere around here. A skeleton, a skeleton train spawned down here. I guess it must have dropped in from above. Literally. <coughs> Lily, stop it. <coughs> stop barking at nothing, dog. Alright, where is this guy? Come on. 
seeing him. I guess normally in survival you wouldn't want one of these guys to spawn because uh, you're probably going to end up setting off a couple of streakers if, if one does spawn. But I want one to spawn and one's not spawning. Yeah. Oh, so he makes three nice. Just said they spawn in the deep dark and the uh, Asian cities. So why isn't one spawning? I'm running around like a madman looking for one of these guys. And there's just none to be found. Oh there's one. Boom, boom. Oh, I well, kill him. Oh, yeah, I did kill him. Okay, that's good. Where is this element of guy? There he is. Die. Uh, Don't get what the electric guy is on the ground. I would imagine uh, if I uh, if I was making this at dawn, I would have made it so that they spawn during thunderstorms. Not super common down here either. quite rare spawning. I don't know, they've all just like spawned somewhere else and I've not found them. But yeah, finding these guys is half the problem, especially like all the streakers and the warden. But...
a little bit more information on like how they spawn. If it, is there anything like particular? About it? I guess if there was something particular about their spawn, they would have said it in the book. Or at least I'm assuming so. It's really not super common. No, oh, it isn't on there. So yeah, I would very much recommend getting rid of all the uh, all the shriekers before you attempt to get one of these guys. You might end up I'm gonna see if I can kill them. Yep, he killed me first. Oh, keep inventory wasn't on. Uh. TP at P. What do you say? 787 50 51. Boom. There we go. I forgot to keep inventory, wasn't on. Just to show how powerful the warden is, even though like, with like what is probably the most powerful add on uh, uh, the most powerful add on uh, armor set. Uh, still not gonna be easy to kill. Anyway, uh boom. There we go. And sleep real quick. Alright. Yep. Yep. There we go. So to make the staff you just need sticks, just like the fire one. And then you make one of each spell, you fuse them all together, and you get the invisible staff. So if we right click, it sends out like a wave of lightning in front of you. If I jump and right click, AOE of electricity, and then shift right click. Oh, that, this one actually looks like it's quite range. Hold on. Ah, uh, no. Okay, that's annoying. So it's going to be difficult to figure out how, uh, you know. You can actually hit, uh, can I hit you from there? Yeah. It does have a bit of range, but not a ton of range. Yeah, I can from there. Uh, what, what I would, yeah, my only real complaint with this staff is that I change the, uh, the spawn location from Deep Dark and the, the um, yeah, Asian cities to just when it's thunderstorming. Well, then they're not too bad. It just feels a bit more thematic that they, that they spawn during thunderstorms instead. Right, next up is the air guardian spawns naturally in mountains. Hmm, if only my base was surrounded by mountains. Oh, wait, it is. Ale, 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 ale. Right, we're just gonna fly up here and we're gonna wait for one to spawn.
Got a goat. So we know we're in the mountains. Now I'm just gonna wait for one of these guys to spawn. Why is it lagging so much? Can't find any. Oh, let's try flying around. I think I'm going to turn that off for a bit because I'm pretty cool now and my lips are starting to dry out. Maybe I just want regular mountains and not snowy mountains? Try over there. That's definitely a regular mountain, not a snowy one. Yeah, let's go check over there real quick, see if it's just because it wants a regular mountain and not a snowy one. Is that a pillager? Yep, you're a bit far away from the outpost. Wow! Yeah. Hmm. Still not seeing any of them though. This is definitely a mountain and not that's not snowy. Hmm. Come on, something, yeah, definitely mountains because there's an emerald all over there. So there's definitely mountains. It's not snowy. Lily, stop growling. Lily. There's nothing to be growling at. Stop it. Yeah, this is not. I see something moved on there. It's my mind playing tricks on me. Oh. Uh, Probably just a wandering toolsmith or tinker or whatever they're called. Or a sheep. Hmm. I 
Is this annoying you? Lily, stop it. Well, two and a right next to each other, the only thing that was possible. Bloody me. Mm. Yeah, but none of just none of them are spawning. Now, I don't know what's up with this spawning or not. Definitely not spawning here either. Well, not definitely. Like, I don't know. Am I doing something wrong? I'm pretty sure I'm not. I'm just hanging around the mountains and none of them are spawning. Hmm. Well, I'm not going to waste any more time looking for them. What I'm going to do is I'm going to teleport back to base and summon one there. Why? Yeah. Wait. Why am I here? Oh, this stupid... Well, I deleted this right. Why did it to just decide to remember it for no reason? God damn it. Ah, uh, yeah. Damn it. Up. Okay, so. Like I said, this world is a bit uh, odd with some add ons, like again, Tinker's Construct. Uh, uh, didn't work very well, and that's probably why we can't see the uh, stash once we've crafted them with the uh, spells. But I don't know if that, I don't know if that's what effect is affecting their spawning in the mountains or not. All I know is that they're not spawning, so I've got to, you know, summon one in myself. Um, really. Um, I don't know. Maybe it like has to be a specific type of mountain or something. I do not know, but it's just the all I know is that they're not spawning in my snowy biome mountains or on the regular mountain. So yeah, I just got spawn in, unfortunately. Maybe I was just. Maybe I was just unlucky and it just wasn't spawning, I don't know. Anyway, so it was, uh, air. Yeah. Someone here. Yeah. Elemental. Yeah, there. Oh. Stupid armor. Hold on. I'm gonna take off the helmet so they don't get teleported away instantly. I think he teleported into you. Oh. He's in the storage system. Oh no. There we go. He's dead. Alright, there's someone another one in, and this time he won't get teleported into the story system. Instantly. 
Yeah, this guy looks pretty cool. Definitely have to miss him. He did, well, they didn't spawn and I didn't just miss it. It's, it's, I don't know. Alright, so. Yeah. One enchanted air stuff. Tornado, air spikes, air blow. Enchanted stuff. Whatever. Let's jump up here. Uh, ten. Right, day. Right, so we've got the right click ability. Let's test it off on the sniffer. Baby sniffer. Which makes a tornado, which is basically the same as that fire spin attack from earlier. Got jump right click. Which is the same as like the fire breath attack. And I got shift right click. Which is just like AoE. Yep. Pretty cool, but it's just like the same as the others, so not as cool. So yeah, but uh, I don't know about like any damage, how much damage each one does. It might uh, go through the book and see if that. Uh, later and see if that uh, tells me anything about how much damage they do. So that's the air staff. Now we've got the water guardian that makes uh, that spawns in the ocean bombs. Right before I go. Right, so teleporter. Delete. Home. Teleporter. Home. Created. I guess I just gotta go to the ocean biome and uh, find one of these dudes. Now I did have a teleport to the forest here, but I'm guessing that's gonna be forgotten just like the home one was forgotten. Anyway. Do do me. Alright, so we got. I don't know if this counts as an ocean. Pretty sure it is an ocean. We've got a large body of water here. Let's see if it spawns here. Hey, got a little. Mon. Like, ruin here. Pretty sure they only spawn in the ocean. Right and round. So, yeah, dolphins only spawn on in oceans as well, so this is definitely an ocean biome. Just gotta wait for one to spawn, I guess. Yeah. 
You eat things. This guy's not spawning there too often either. Guardians or whatever you want to call them. Yeah, I'm calling them two things. training grounds. Well, there's a lot of training grounds even oh even for bedrock edition. There's a ship right there. It's supposed to be just supposed to be uh, well or if the world spot well, because the world's very buggy. Either way, I'm not gonna waste any more time looking for one, I'm just gonna summon one in. I'll do it here because uh more accurately represent what it's what if I were supposed to look at look like. Yeah, this is what one's supposed to look like. That's yep. There, okay, so they. Use, I don't know if they spawn on the water and float to the top, but they, you'll find them float on the top if one does spawn. I'm not. Uh, unless I'm just like missing one, I'm not seeing any spawning. Yeah, let's kill a few more of these. If I will be more enough, I unlock something. Boom. There we go. Wandering oh. traders are dying for some reason. Oh. <laughs> I think he jumped off the roof anyway. So, water. 
我的 staff， 我的 bubble， tsunami wave， and whale ball。Uh, let me just real quick dump them in. Right. Look up. Right click. This is a wall of water, basically. Doesn't play out the campfire. And we have jump right click. You just like a bubble that flies with them. You got shift right click. Oh, shift right click. Which is like it's just the same as the fire and air one, basically, but with water this time. Yeah, pretty cool. And yeah, then we got the spirit one, which is just guardian, which spawns in the cherry grove. Which I saw one in this direction when I was on my way to the deep dark. Not far away at all. Just over the hill and not so far away. Is a cherry groove. Yes, it is a bit small though. Also, I should set time today. Time sunrise. Oh, there's a village there. Oh, I've been here before because I've come to get cherry wood apparently. Ah, there's one. Found this one way easier than last. Yep. Come on, die. Ow. Die. Dead. Ah. Huh. I don't think that one dropped anything. No, that one definitely did. Yeah, these are spawning. Where? Yeah, oh my god, there's so many eggs. It's a murder in time. Ah, poop. Like six, six, nine. Ah, I forgot what the wire was. Yeah, I'll just put 64. Yeah. You know one. It was 102. 102. Oh, it didn't even. 
save my inventory properly because I was flying and my chest plate's gone. Why is my chest plate gone? Where's my chest plate? Is this in here? Yes, it is. So is my sword. And my inventory is a mess. Great. Air, fire, electricity, air. Yeah, air, air, fire, electricity, water. Yeah, I think I got all them. Back? Yeah. Right. Teleporter. Home. Oh, this stupid thing. Oh, this thing's rubbish. I could just be my world being bug, because again, it is a bit buggy with some add-ons, but I shouldn't be forgetting them like every five seconds. Don't worry, I'm just going to get rid of it because it's not been helpful. Well, actually, it was helpful to turn, turn it today, but I could just do game work, game work there. It's a time. Zero. Then we make the I don't want water. Put the water in there. Okay, what was it? A spirit. Oh, this one's a lot more expensive. You need three eyes of Ender. Boom. 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 Celestial Charge, Ethereal Blades, and the Nebula Vortex. This one's not even animated. Because like, all the other like spinny things they were animated, this one's not animated. Maybe again it could be just like the world is a bit buggy. Probably should change it over to a different world. Anyway, so there's right click. So let's set out. There's jump right click, which does a vortex. And then there's shift right click, which does ethereal plates, which is very close range. I don't think ethereal blades honestly will be very useful because, um, you're going to be getting hit, bef you're probably going to be getting hit before you can even do damage, so let's just, uh, summon, um, I don't know, let's summon, oh, I don't know, summon a zombie because I'll sell fire. Witch. Let's summon a witch. Shift right click. Which one was it? Was it jump right click? Oh, I bet it's been using that because it, I keep it. So, yeah, it's even like difficult to use the right one because you're getting knocked up in the air when you're in battle. There you go. Yeah, not super. It's on the... Yeah, I really wouldn't recommend that. Which is really disappointing for how expensive it was. It's like three eyes of Ender, and for that, so you, have to, you have to go to the Never. Really. And that, and then the pill sounds really easy to get before the end, and it, and it's just, it just does not do enough damage to even kill a witch because the witch can just heal herself, 
and they're all just on constant cooldown. I could just stab and kill it that easily. So yeah. Alright, time for the final verdict. Um it it looks like it, it does look cool, like the uh, staff, they do look cool. But as you saw they just don't even like really do enough damage to kill a single witch. Which again is really surprising for the spiritual one because you need an eyes of ender for that. And they don't, yeah, they're all just a bit underpowered considering you have to beat not a super difficult enemy, but you have to defeat a fairly difficult enemy to get them. And it doesn't really tell you how much damage each one does, I don't think. Yeah, it's not, doesn't, it's like, it doesn't even tell you how much damage it does. And I think that, that's done purposely because they don't really do a lot of damage. Like, this is surprising. Hold on, let's... Let me hop into a separate world. So I've got this other world. I'm going to put this back on because I'm getting hot again. Um, I'm going to jump into this other world and see if, like, it's just that world being bulk and they're just not doing as much damage as they're supposed to be doing. Yeah. So I'm going to hop into, um... This world. Oh, and uh, what they have health bars, yeah, that's fine. Uh, gonna add the elemental bending, and where's the damage? Oh, there it is damage indicators play. Right, so staff. So we got air staff, electric staff, fire. Okay, so yeah, so staff, staff, staff. Got air, electric, fire, water, and there's air. What so? It, so that's the one in China one, that's that one. Mm. And then it was the uh, spirit. Let's see, we have the switch. Yeah, it's, it wasn't bold. Look how little damage it's doing to this witch. It's literally impossible to kill this witch with these stats. She's just gonna heal up. Zero, 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 zero. zero. Okay, I think the uh, damage indicator might be a bit off, but you can see that because you can see the health bar above her head, she is taking some damage. And it's just doing so little that you'd never be able to kill her with the uh, cooldown. Because you'll just use a health potion. Actually, the fire one's not doing too bad. Yeah. You just... Why is that black? Okay. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, you're just not. You're just not doing enough damage. Maybe if he did this from a bit further away and then the air floor would... No, uh, she's dropped into the hole. Yeah. You know, like I said, you're just not doing enough damage to even kill this witch. Especially with the cooldowns. Like, if there wasn't a cooldown... Then maybe you'd be able to kill the witch with the fire staff. <laughs> but they just do too way too little damage. So yeah. I would I cannot recommend this as it is right now, because they just do too little damage to even kill a witch. Also, this one's not even animated, like come on. So what they need to do is buff all of these so they do way more damage. Like Literally just like they're doing like one or two damage. Like they need to be doing way more damage so that they at least can kill a witch. Like why, like ask me, answer this question. Why would you bother killing those um, elemental guardians to get, to craft these up when I could just get a stick and two diamonds and stab her in the face a couple of times and kill her way faster. And that, and that, yeah, that, what ne that, that needs to be done. Like, they just need to do way more damage, like, seriously. And also, vary them up a bit, because a lot of the, uh, as you've seen in this, a lot of them are just, like, variations on each other. You know, just, like, basically, like, copy and paste with a different effect. They need to be, and they also need to do, like, they need, some of them need to be long range, like, there needs to be one I can just, like, shoot her off into the distance and, like, like, Kill a, to like kill a gas or something because none of these really do damage it that far away All right you're never gonna be able to kill a gas with one of these weapons because the gas will just fly away like this doesn't even one shot a bleeding mushroom and it only has it only did like six damage to this mushroom <laughs> There's just too much. They they can they just walk out of it. There's too much wind up. There's a cooldown. Like look at that wind up and that cooldown as well. Like sure, keep the wind up. Axe the cooldown. Like kill. You know we don't need the cooldown. Just keep the wind up because the wind up is it's the wind up is already effectively a cooldown in and of itself. You don't need a uh, needed to charge up the attack. Then. Uh, also cool down after the attack. That is just way too much. And they just just so axe the cooldown, buff the attack, then maybe it'll be worth using. But other than that, I cannot recommend this at all. Especially because I think there's pre I'm pretty sure there's like five pounds. Pretty much four or five four pounds, five pounds, something like that. It's just like no. I know, I cannot recommend this at this point in time. But yeah, I hope you guys all did enjoy this video. I hope to see you guys in the next one and hopefully this will get updated soon and I can make an update video. Just like, hey, been damage buff, at cooldown got axe, can I actually recommend? Maybe. Anyway. And bye bye.